this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2020 Mitsubishi Outlander LE. This vehicle features a 2.4 liter inline four engine with all wheel drive, and there have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax. As we get closer here to the front of this SUV, you'll be able to see that it is a sleek metallic silver clear coat with chrome and black accents as you'll be able to see there on the front grille, as well as down around those fog lights. Those fog lights will help you out in inclement weather, and speaking of inclement weather, we'll come along here to the side and take a look at this vehicle's tires and wheels. This vehicle features black 18-inch aluminum alloy wheels, and as for the tire treads, you have got a good amount of life left in them, but I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second, as this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection, as well as received a fresh oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. Here on the outside of your mirror caps, you do have your turn signals integrated into those. And on the insides on the mirrors, you do have a blind spot indicator that will light up if there's anybody in your blind spot, helping you to drive just a little bit safer. And on the top of this SUV, you do have black roof rails if you ever want to transport anything up there. Lastly, we'll take a look at the handles here, as this vehicle does feature passive keyless entry, which is really convenient. Basically, if the vehicle is locked, you'll be able to get into it without ever having to take the keys out of your pocket or your purse. We'll now take a look here to the inside of this SUV. Here on the inside of this vehicle, you'll be able to see you have a lovely jet black upholstery on these seats for a smooth and comfortable ride with some lovely scarlet stitching to accent that. And like I mentioned earlier, you do have those chrome and black accents making their way up the dashboard. While we're looking over here, I'll just open up the glove box and bring you the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. And as you'll be able to see here on this inspection form, you do have green checks the entire way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 10 30 seconds in both your front tires and 9 30 seconds in both your rear tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 7 30 seconds in the front and 10 30 seconds in the rear. So you have a long ways to go before you need to replace any of those wearables. I'd also like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get the original owner's manual with it as well. So if you have any questions after you buy it, you'll be able to look them up in there. We'll now continue around to take a look here at the rear occupant seating. You'll be able to see back here that there are three rows of seats to seat a total of seven people in this SUV. And for this row of occupants in particular, if you have two people sitting here instead of three, this middle seat does fold down to become an additional armrest with two cup holders in it. You also have USB charging ports back here for these rear occupants, as well as a pocket on the back of that front passenger seat. You also have cup holders and charging ports back here for this far row of rear occupants as well. And down on the floor, you do have carpeted floor mats to help keep your floors nice and clean. Over here on the door, all of the doors do have a cup holder in them as well as powered windows. I'll just close that and we'll continue around to take a look here at the rear of this SUV. On the back of this SUV, you do have a rear backup camera to help you whenever you're parking or going in reverse. And I'll just put up the tailgate to show you how much space you have here in the rear area. Alright, as you'll be able to see back here, you don't have a ton of space, maybe enough for a small grocery run, but those seats do fold down to give you a lot more space. You also have a small lip here to help prevent anything from rolling out. And if you open this up, it will reveal a small storage compartment underneath the floorboards for anything you might want to put in there. I'll just put the tailgate back down, and we'll continue around to the driver's side. I would like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys for your convenience and to help prevent you from ever getting locked out. This vehicle does come with powered mirrors, powered windows, and powered door locks. And as for the driver's seat, you do have eight-way powered seating adjustments, so you can move the seat forwards, backwards, up, down, tilting the seat forward and back, and then two-directional lumbar support. You also have a telescopic steering wheel with this vehicle, and you can move it in and out as well as up and down to fit you as you like. And to the left of that steering wheel, you do have a forward collision warning with this vehicle, as well as a lane departure warning. I'm going to just get in this SUV and turn it on for you. This vehicle is a push to start. And now that the engine is running and the dashboard is lit up, you'll be able to see that this vehicle has about 55,716 miles on it. We'll take your attention over here to the left side of the steering wheel, as over here are your volume controls as well as your Bluetooth and call controls, as this vehicle does have hands-free Bluetooth. And on the right side of the steering wheel are your cruise controls. We'll now take a look here to the center of this vehicle. 
here in the center of the vehicle you do have a lovely touchscreen LCD display and I'll just throw it in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. Underneath that display you do have buttons for it. A bit farther down is your climate controls right there. Further down still you do have a power outlet here as well as a USB charging port. Right behind that you do have two cup holders, your main gear shift, parking brake, the front driver's seat and the front passenger seat are both heated, and then your main storage compartment behind that. Lastly, we'll take a look up, as underneath the mirrors, you do have a built-in garage door opener in this vehicle. And up there on the ceiling, you do have a powered sunroof to really enjoy those sunny summer days. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. Here in the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, leaks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, so we want you to know what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So as I'm looking around the inside of this SUV, you have some slight, slight wear, such as some scuffing on the center console. But other than that, there is nothing significant that really stands out to me. There are no odors or scents whatsoever. So we'll move along to take a look here now at the outside of this vehicle. We'll be looking up and down again for any of those imperfections, starting by coming along here to the front. And here along the front, we do have several small nicks, most likely from stone chips. Stone chipping is extremely common. Almost every vehicle has some form of it. The only way you can really prevent it is just by not driving your vehicle. We'll come along here now to the passenger side. You have some scuffing there on the rear cap. Small nick right there. This vehicle is a lighter color, so it does tend to show a little more than a darker color might. Now as we come here to the rear of this vehicle, a place where I often see imperfections is where the tailgate meets the bumper as people don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. But as I take a look here, you do have some faint scuffing on that black plastic, but it is mostly intact. And as for the bumper, you do have some scratching there. I'll just put the tailgate back down. And we'll continue back around to the driver's side. Some scuffing there. And a nick. A nick there. We did touch it up, but it is still there. And we are back to where we started. That generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a silver small SUV with the ability to seat seven, fold down seats with a backup camera, black roof rails, carpeted floor mats, a blind spot monitor, lane departure warning, a power sunroof, a built in garage door opener, heated front seats, fog lights, hands free Bluetooth, passive keyless entry, two keys and all wheel drive, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive. Located at 21518 Great Cove Road, Connellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this small SUV and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.